Fox News anchor Brett Baer just listed his D.C. home for a whopping $32 million. The Wall Street Journal says if it goes for asking price, it'll be the most expensive residential sale in the district's history. The 16,000-square-foot estate was completed last year, and it sits on nearly one and a half acres. It has five bedrooms, seven bathrooms, and two half baths. It also features a custom bar with a floor-to-ceiling wine display, indoor sports court, and a 56... I'm, I'm like, I'm looking at the pictures, Sharan. I'm like, I'm like, I don't want to read the script. I want to look at the pictures. But it does include an indoor sports court and a 56-foot-long heated Ooh. pool. Yeah, the pool is what got me. I mean, That's amazing. Stunning. Stunning. I think uh, Kenneth and I should just go in and have, yeah, you know, 16 hassy. million. Not so bad. <laughs> uh, home sales fell for the fourth month, by the way, in a row. Speaking of homes, the National Association of Realtors says the rate fell down 2% from August. This comes as prospective buyers are dealing with high mortgage rates and the low level of homes available. The association says this is the slowest sale pace since October 2010. And officials in Montgomery County gathered to celebrate the opening of a $38 million affordable housing project in Tacoma Park. The ribbon was cut, launching the newly renovated colonnade at the Creek Apartment Community, formerly known as the Hillwood Manor. The building consists of 96 units from one to four bedrooms. This project is a testament to our shared vision of delivering quality affordable housing to the people of this county. We also want to thank our philanthropic partners who provided additional support for this project. And this is a part of the county's effort to rehabilitate affordable homes along the Purple Line.